Hello, welcome to my channel. <sighs> I just did some hiking. Joshua Tree is right behind me, the state park. I want to talk today about black magic. Considering I just got cursed by a young lady. <sighs> There's different kinds of black magic. There's black magic you would do on a ex-boyfriend or girlfriend. There's curses, and there's also sex magic, where you masturbate to their picture excessively, trying to either get them back, or you mess with their energy so they don't find nobody else, so they obsess back over you, <clears throat> like a mirroring energy. <sighs> but black magic in general is just no bueno. This young lady that did that to me, I don't know if it was this reader's you know, they have moderators that go through all their comments. and So, it was a private. I should have just emailed her. That was my fault. This young lady had no business being in it. But she took offense. She took offense to me unsubscribing to her channel. So she decided to curse me. Here's the problem with that. That curse is going to come back to her. It always does. People don't understand that. Even if you succeed in the curse... That becomes your karma. And if you don't make that right, that karma is going to be sent to your kids and your grandkids. I have a feeling that poor young lady is going to have a really bad week. Because I am highly protected. I was concerned when I first started because I have family. And I was concerned about the curses and the, and the juju and the dark magic that would come my way for stepping out into the light. And, be, and claiming my power. But I was confirmed that I was protected by powerful angels. I have a video about that a long time ago. I was, it was, I was sitting there in my vehicle and I was doing a video and I was like, wouldn't it be cool if I could do a confirmation on my angel's protection? And where I was at, I was always seeing bald eagles. So I was like, wouldn't it be cool if I just opened up my door and just looked out of the ocean and a bald eagle flew by while well, I was just talking about this, you know, my protection. And as I said that, I looked out and I was like, hmm. And it just hit, it hit something hit me to, to look up. So I did. Two bald eagles circling my vehicle right above me. And they hung out for a while. They did like mock dives and it was really beautiful. So I have no doubt that God and the universe are protecting me. My angels have my back. So that young lady sending me that curse is going to have a bad day. I hope, I pray that the reader who I commented on, doesn't get affected by that. Because it wasn't her comment. It wasn't her curse. I will hope that she wasn't a part of it. Because I really cared about that person. I thought that she was an important part of my teaching. But like I said, if she if she told that girl to do it, then she's going to be part of it, unfortunately. Like I said, curses will come back to you. They're not something to be played with. Black magic is not something you want to mess with. I'm just saying. And that's a sad thing when people do that. But they're out there. They're demonic, they're dark spirited, they're full of hate and confusion. Like I said, blood sacrifice, killing babies, all that stuff. It's all part of it. It's really bizarre, but it's all linked to the magic. It's all linked to the spiritual. It's all linked to power and control and the dark and the light. And I want you to run in the light because that's important. I just heard a hawk. Check this out. You see that hawk flying? What's up, baby? <whistles> so beautiful. Yeah. See what I'm saying? I'm protected, babe. So in the future, if you're watching this video and you are hating on me, I would be very careful about attacking me. Because it will come back tenfold, baby. So just don't do it. Learn how to love and have a wonderful day. I love you, God loves you, and the universe is crazy about you. So stay pure and keep your thoughts pure. Love you.